what's up you guys welcome back to my channel this is a very impromptu video because I have been in experimenting all day with keto chaffle recipes I have a bunch of stuff cooling back there don't mind my kitchen it's a wreck because I've been doing this all day I did chocolate strawberry lemon cinnamon banana cauliflower chaffles um, like the bread like ones to put in my freezer the best sweet one that I found is the lemon one. So I'm gonna do a video, quick video on the lemon one and I hope you guys enjoy it. All right, you guys, this is the first step. I have some um, cream cheese here. It's just two teaspoons of cream cheese that I microwave for 10 seconds. Just makes it really smooth and allows you to put everything else in there. I'm gonna go ahead and preheat my waffle iron. And then to this, we're gonna add several things. So the first thing is one egg. All right. And then we're gonna add a half a teaspoon of lemon extract. This is the one that I have, let me see. That's the one that I have. It is Aldi brand or Kroger brand. I don't know where I got it. <laughs> but just half a teaspoon. And then we're gonna go ahead and whisk these together. Um, I will use a spoon when I pour it in, but usually I just use a fork to actually make the chocolates. And these don't have to be like perfectly together like a pancake batter or something. Because we're going to do it in stages. Now we're going to take one tablespoon of almond flour. I just keep it in a baggie because I have a huge bag from Costco. It's just easier to do it in a baggie. And then we're going to do some baking powder, which is back here. The recipe calls for a quarter of a teaspoon. I only have an eighth of a teaspoon, so I just kind of do it overflowing. Alright. And then two Splenda. Uh, you can use whatever sweetener you like, but I do Splenda just because that's my preferred sweetener. I'm just going to mix that all together. Scrape it off on the side. This is the boring part. Alright. Our waffle maker is preheated. I'm going to go ahead and pour this in there. Let me grab a spoon real quick. Alright, first thing we're going to do, open our waffle maker. I had uh, steamed it clean a minute ago, so if you see it's a lot of steam, that's why. <laughs> I put down some mozzarella, because mozzarella doesn't really taste like anything. It tastes like whatever you put in it. And then just pour this. Probably could have used a little bit more mozzarella, but that's all right. Pour it in there. Let it set for just a minute. And then we're going to do some more mozzarella on top. And then just close it, and you'll set a timer for three minutes, and then check it. All right, guys, moment of truth. Move you a little bit so you can see. So that is our lemon chaffle. And I usually just take it out with a knife because I don't know why. Because I'm dangerous. <laughs> and that is our final product. It is so delicious. Enjoy, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want more recipes like this, let me know down in the comments below. If you like this, get subscribed. And if you have any questions or comments about how I make chaffles or anything else, let me know. And here's to seeing less of me in the next video.